Hello, this is Coach Johnny with the Chicago Fire. I have another English Premier League opinions piece for world-class coaching. So the international football has gone away. We're back to the Premier League. Fantastic. But what also returned? Horrible refereeing. I know it's an old subject. We talk about it all the time. Keep complaining about it, but it never improves. Once again, a weekend of games spoiled or at least affected by incompetent refereeing decisions. There are a number of solutions out there. Add more referees, add a video referee, but somehow nothing seems to change. Premier League, I think, has to take a stand on this. Uh, the standard of refereeing is just appalling in the Premier League at the moment. And we go back to this last weekend. It, no better. Getting worse, perhaps. Vincent Company in a Manchester City Leicester game. Uh, surely that's a red card. Uh, Manchester City go on to win the game 2 0. I think a goal down and a man down. Maybe there's a different result in that game. Uh, Umanias at Everton dives for a penalty, blatant penalty, uh, scores that. Picks up points for Everton. Um, Glenn Murray in a Brighton game uh, should have had a penalty. Uh, but the biggest one for me was the Arsenal-Tottenham game. First game of the weekend. I'm sure there are other incidences across the weekend, but just want to focus on this game. Once again, the outcome of the game affected by appalling refereeing. You had the incident where the long ball goes into Alexis Sanchez. Beautiful touch from Sanchez. And then Davison Sanchez comes. And for me... Uh, he plays a fantastic piece of defending. Referee disagrees, says it's a foul. Free kick then comes into the penalty box. Mustafi, of course, offside, very clear. We have the instant replay just two seconds later. Nice little line drawn on the screen, uh, clearly offside. Not given. Goal stands. 1-0 to Arsenal. A little bit later in the game, Lacazette offside. 2-0. Uh, game affected by poor refereeing decision. So what is the solution? So maybe the VAR, the video assisted referee, is going to come into the Premier League at some point in time. But even that I don't think is going to solve the problem. All you'll have then is the argument, the debate uh, at a different referee. For me, at the moment, the quality of refereeing is so poor and it needs to change. And first thing that needs to change is we have to establish what is a foul, what is a red card, what is a handball, what exactly is offside. Because the decisions right now, depending on whichever referee you get, uh, this is a different outcome. So like I say, even if it does go to a video appeal, all you'll have is the argument focused that instead of the guy in a Santa circle with the whistle, the guy in a, in a booth or looking at a laptop upstairs. It needs to change. But whether it's the International Football Association Board or FIFA or the Premier League taking a, a pioneering uh, step here to, to rectify refereeing, the first thing that needs to change is we need to establish what is a foul, what is offside, what is a handball. Far too much inconsistency across the board. Uh, my club, my player gets penalised for this foul and it ends up being a penalty. And then later in the game or next weekend, uh, different referee, same situation, different outcome. So it needs changing, it needs improving, and it needs improving very, very quickly. But the first thing that needs to change is not just adding another referee with a video. What we need to do is establish what is a handball, what is a foul, what is a red card foul, what is offside. Once we've established that, and you can say this is offside, this is also offside, this is not offside, and then everyone's on the same page. We got half a chance of video referees being able to arbitrate the game correctly. So, just my opinion, frustrating weekend on referees. I know it's an old subject, but it seems ubiquitous. It seems to be never going away. So, I just want to uh, share my opinions and hear what you guys have got to say. You got any thoughts on it? You got other ways to improve the refereeing? Let us know. Leave a comment uh, at the, below. Uh, we're always uh, happy to read them, and we're always happy to reply. So, thanks for listening, guys, and we'll speak soon. Bye now.